hello guys welcome back to my youtube channel being engineer you are on my channel because you are an engineer and you want to learn different engineering topics but if you are new to my channel you are requested to please subscribe it and press the bell icon to get more informative videos being engineer so in this video we are going to calculate the unit weight of a steel bar in lbs per feet or if you have a weight of a bar in lbs per feet and how can, then how can you convert it into kg per millimeters as we know that the imperial bar sizes are available either in inches which is represented by a hash sign or in millimeters as you can see either we use this fps system or mks system what would be the different sizes of different bars we will also calculate the area of a steel in inch square and in millimeters and the conversion of inch to millimeter we will be using these two formulas to calculate the unit weight of a bar so let's start our today's topic first of all look at this table these are the imperial bar sizes which are in fps system that is hash 3 that is hash 3 number 3 bar it could be read as number 3 bar which means that 3 by 8 inches number 3 means 3 by 8 inches number 4 means 4 by 8 inches or 1 by 2 inches half inches number 5 means 5 by 8 similarly number 8 means 8 by 8 which comes out to be 1 inch number 9 means 9 divided by n and similarly it goes on and the unit weight per fit that is weight of a bar if a bar is one fit long and what would be the weight of that bar it is 0 0.376 and in kg it comes out to be 0 0.561 kg per meter these are the nominal diameters for these bars number three number four and in millimeters the dia of number three bar is 9.525 and its area in square inches is 0 0.11 and in millimeters is 71 okay in the upcoming slide I will tell you how can we enter convert these values for example if the area in inch square is given then how can you convert it into millimeters or if the dia of bar is given in millimeters then how can you convert it into inches so let's proceed let's suppose we have number 3 bar and its nominal diameter is 3 by 8 inches that is 0 0.375 and the unit weight of a bar that is if we have a one fit long bar what would be its weight of number three bar okay i will tell you how to calculate this weight that is weight per unit meter that is per unit length or in kgs 0 0.561 let's see we have you uh, we have to use this formula if we are using this fps fps system that is w is equal to d square divided by 52.9 in different uh, books you will see it could be 52.7 52.6 52.8 it is an approximate formula but it doesn't make much difference if you use 52.6 or 52.9 we will be using this formula w is equal to d square divided by 52.9 now d is the diameter of the bar for example over here we are using number 3 bar it would be 3 square divided by 52.9 and it comes out to be 0 0.170 kg per fit it gives the answer in kg per fit but over here we have because kg is from other uh, system of unit and fit is from other so we will convert it into the same system of unit that is lb per fit and we know that 1 kg is equal to 2.204 lbs so by multiplying 0 0.170 with 2.204 we will get the value 0 0.375 lbs per fit this is the weight of a bar if its length is one fit it would uh, it weight will be 0 0.375 lbs similarly for mk system or for kg per meter we will use this formula w is equal to d square divided by 162.162 or we can directly convert it that is kg per fit to kg per meter as we know that 
वन फिट इज इक्वल टू वन डिवाइडेड बाई थ्री पॉइंट टू एट मीटर एंड बाई सिंप्लीफाइंग इट दैट इज जीरो पॉइंट वन सेवन जीरो मल्टीप्लाई बाई थ्री पॉइंट टू एट वी विल गेट जीरो पॉइंट फाइव सिक्स सिक्स के जी पर मीटर एज यू कैन सी हेवर अवर हेयर इट्स मिनिमल डिफरेंस जीरो पॉइंट फाइव सिक्स वन एंड जीरो पॉइंट फाइव सिक्स सिक्स सो बाई यूजिंग ओनली दिस फॉर्मूला एंड इफ यू नो दिस कन्वर्जन ऑफ फ्रॉम फ्रॉम मीटर टू इंच यू कैन इजिली गेट दिस वैल्यू this value is in lb per feet and this value is in kg per meter or you can directly use this formula that is d square d is the diameter of a bar in millimeters that is 9.525 divided by 162.162 it comes out 0.559 kg per meter okay as you can see over here 0.561 and we have got 0.559. Again, it's a minimal uh, difference. You can use this formula. So these are the two formulas to get the unit weight of a bar in lb per feet and kg per meter. Or you can interconvert these formulas. Uh, in the this slide, I am going to tell you about the nominal areas. How can we calculate the area of a bar in inches or in millimeters? So the area of a circle as we know that is pi by 4 d square the value of pi is 3.14 divided by 4 and diameter of a bar is 0.375 square or 37 six square it comes out 0.11 square inches as you can see over here 0.11 inch square it's the area of a bar in square inches similarly again the area of a circle is pi by 4 d square and the diameter of a bar in millimeter is 0.561 or the one we calculated is 0.559 then simplifying it we will get 71.2 millimeters as you can see over here is 71 millimeter square so in this way you can calculate the areas and unit weight of a different imperial bars available in the market with different units are which could be either in inches or millimeters by using these simple formulas you can calculate the unit weight and areas of a bar so that's all for today thanks for watching and if you are new to my channel please subscribe it and press the bell icon to get more video updates